Hey, I'm Todd Alsup. We're here in New York City for my Yamaha All Access photo shoot. Come on in. I grew up uh, in the suburbs of Detroit, so around the age of five, I discovered my parents' Motown collection. I just thought that that was about the best thing I'd ever heard. I would describe my style as pop soul, very much influenced by uh, the more kind of like classic sounds of like 60s, 70s pop, Stevie Wonder, Elton John, Billy Joel. You know, as early as anybody remembers, I was just like making noise, banging on pots and pans in the basement, dancing around the living room. Music was just my thing. And I didn't really come from a family of musicians. I come from a family of a lot of athletes. Nobody's really musically inclined, so it was clearly something that was just like innate. I always knew that New York City was like the place that I wanted to end up, and New York University kind of seemed like the perfect <laughs> passport. So I was like, if I can get into that school, I'm there. And happily, it was the only school that I applied to. It was a lifelong dream, and the city just fuels my creativity. I'm not signed to a major label. I released my last two records on my own, which is an interesting journey all its own. It's, I think it's a, an interesting time in the music industry because artists are proving that that can work. You know, of course, the, the carrot at the end of the stick is that like, if it works, it's all you, baby. It's empowering. It's also a source of a lot of stress. So my producers, Steve Green, all sort of posed the question. He said, well, do you want the record to sound like it was made for Z100 now, or a record that sounds like it could have been made in 1973? And I was like, 1973 will do just fine. Right now, uh, with the record released, I'm in the mode of sort of like going back to the drawing board and uh, we're shooting a music video this summer, so I'm in the process of sort of planning that out. Um, we have a remix that's coming out this summer, the first single. I love Yamaha pianos because I love the tone. I think the tone is always gorgeous. The action is always really great. Um, I've never had an issue. Like I always just really love, and I, I sit down at my piano constantly. You know, when you feel comfortable on your instruments, it really makes room to be creative, to be playful. I think that's what I love about my Yamaha, is that I, I, I really always feel at home on it. Hey guys, thanks for checking out my interview. Check out my site, toddallsip.com, and I hope to see you at a show sometime soon.